Hello friends, I'm Parviz and this is our fourth video in Python socket. So Python socket programming. Now in the previous video we have learned that how you can get IP address of a website in Python programming language. So this was from the previous video. Uh, in this video uh, I want to show you that how to connect a client socket to a server process. So uh, the following code is an example of uh, a TCP client socket that uh, makes a connection to server socket. So now let's get started. And uh, so the first thing I need, uh, I'm going to import. I have created a new Python file. So let me close this session. Okay. First, I need to import the socket. And now I'm going to create a try. Uh, first, you need to create a socket object. So socket dot socket and the first one is the family I have introduced this uh, you can watch the first video for if you want to know about what are these parameters so I'm using a, a socket dot if inet this is the family and the second one is the type uh, because I want a TCP based socket so for this I'm using sock stream and this, uh, for the protocol I want to give it zero so we have the family, uh, the type, and the protocol. Okay, now after this, except we are getting the errors from the socket, socket error as e print filled to create a socket, filled to create a socket. And also, I want to find write the reason of this. So the reason dot format and e. Also, I need to import sys. I'm going to exit this sys dot exit. Okay. And uh, so, if it was successful, uh, if the socket creation was successful, I'm going to print. You can write this in here, there is no problem, but I'm going to write this in here. So, socket created successfully, socket created successfully, and now uh, I'm going to get the input from the user. So I want to get the hostname and also the port from the user that they want to connect. First target host input and please enter target host name to connect. And so this is for my also for the target port input please enter target port target port okay so now let me just create uh, another uh, because when we want to connect our socket to this uh, target house and target uh, target port uh, there may be chances that we get the we get error, so we need to create a try uh, accept block in here. So try s dot connect, and we want to connect our to the specific target host and target port, and you need to convert this to int like this. And now, if it was successful, I'm going to write socket connected to host plus target host and on port. So on port, target port. And also, you need to shut down this. Shut down this. So, 
this is for cleanup so shut down and in the accept we are going to get the error so error as e and now we need to print field connection to host target host and on port target port also you need to write the reason that why this field convert this to string and accept this so sys dot z okay so now uh, in here uh, you can see also you can just uh, let me just uh, cut all of these and let me write a main method in here and paste it in here like this okay and f underscore name call your main in here so this is a simple uh, TCP, TCP uh, client socket that we make a connection to server socket uh, we have uh, created the socket and this is the exception handling and in here we need to get the user uh, uh, the uh, host name and also port from the user and in here we need to connect this uh, our socket to the target host and target port and in here we print so now uh, let me just run this and so now you can see socket created successfully uh, please enter target host name to connect so first of all let me just uh, run my internet because right now I think I don't have internet connection okay guys now uh, I have internet connection let me run this so please enter target host name to connect now this is my website uh, codelook.org you can get a lot of source codes from here so first let me check this and let me write www.codeloop.org and the port 80 so now you can see socket connected to host www.codeloop.org on port 80 now let me just run this again let me write another www.python.org port 80 so socket connected to host python.org on port 80 so for example if you write anything wrong you will see that an exception so let me write the dot python.org for example port now I will receive an error so I'm waiting for this so guys you can see that this is the error and a connection attempt fell because connected party did not properly properly respond so thank you guys uh, i will add the source code of this uh, video in my website you can check uh, the video description and also please subscribe to my channel like the video and also share the video